Alright guys, so over the past uh, four days, give or take, I've fallen off a bandwagon. Of, not bandwagon, but like the, uh, what is it like, where I continuously do, do stuff, right? So on Friday, I ended up doing five, ten pages of my networking book, which was good. I'm almost done with chapter seven. Um, but I didn't do jack shit when it came to my development course for my for game development. Um, I ended up falling off. Kathy came over, you know, uh, stayed pretty much the whole weekend, and uh, we hung out. We did stuff, which is good. Um, but in the mix, in the mix of that, I didn't do what I know I needed to do and what I wanted to do. On top of that, it's like there's this weird barrier where it's like I need and slash want to do this, but I'm so, but getting out of the groove of something when you're already when you've been when you've been so locked in to, to say okay I get home here's an example get home uh, at X time every day right and then from there walk the dog ah, walk the dog and then um, work out for 30 minutes and then by six o'clock. You know, I'm at doing work. Uh, I'm doing other work, 6, 6.30, let's say. Uh, I'm eating food, doing work, you know. Um, and then from there, I have, say, 30 minutes to an hour to play games or, or, or progress more in the development course or progress more in my networking, whatever. The weekend, I've got to figure out some type of system for, for me that works on, like, hammering down uh, to get this stuff done, right? To say, okay, this is what works for me. Because for some reason, the weekends, I don't have a good system for it. And it's, it's I think, the best time to do it. Uh, realistically, it is the best time because I just have all this freaking time over the weekend. And it's, it's, it's borderline, you could say, a missed opportunity, right? Um, but in the same sense, I could also say, hey, this is also a... Uh, something really good to kind of take a brace a break and to fall back on um, Also on a side note, I went ahead and bought the current WoW and the next WoW expansion So I have a and they gave me free level boost too. So I have a level 110 paladin, which is uh, he's pretty dope uh, Ben fizzy b-i-n-f-i-z-z-y like I've been fizzy, you know what I mean? So I didn't want to do Sin Fizzy as my uh, on the server that we're on to you know as my main character because I don't think the Paladin's gonna be my main. The Paladin's really cool, but I don't think he's gonna be my main. I think I may just end up going back and playing a monk again this uh, this expansion for for the main main chunk of it. That or a shaman, most likely. Uh, we were, we were, he was doing hold and forward and okay and stuff like that because I was trying to get by without getting plowed by a, a roll-off truck. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's that's kind of like the gist of it, you know. I have this idea in my head for my first project, uh, the first uh, development project, and God, it's just, it, it's just nailing down and continue to grow on that project over and over. More ideas are coming to my head, you know, different, different, talking scenes different this that like this project is slowly starting to fill out in my head um and uh, i have to, i have a lot of different concepts and things i have to learn to do it right because you know the, a lot of times you get into something and you're like okay this is going to be my first or my second project where I, where i get into and i um okay let, let's use this as an example right it's like building let's say Let's say you have three shelves to build. The first one is like your test shelf. The second one, you polish out everything that you've learned. And then the, f and then the third one is like, this is the perfect shelf that I can make. Though you still have plenty of little like edging and things like that. I say perfect as in a perfect, there's no such thing. But it's like you learn how to slowly progress and make a better shelf, right? And it's the same thing with, I assume, developing games or doing anything, right? But my first attempt at making a website for the company was pretty good. I didn't have a ton of freedom to do it, right? Uh, and then the second time that I was able to put a month and a half into it, here and there, I edged everything out. I learned a lot, learned a lot of SEO stuff, a lot of development stuff, and then was from there I was able to continue on and... Um, 
uh, make not a perfect website, but a very good website. Um, so, I mean, that's with anything, right? I mean, you, you, you cook chicken, and then if you cook chicken 20 times, eventually you're just you're still going to continuously learn how to make a better, you know, cook the chicken even better, um, and learn to experiment with stuff. But I mean, you're just kind of, you know, you're going to make a better chicken by by time number 10, for example. So, um, these next two development courses that I have, even if I put an hour into them, you know, when I get home tonight, I want to put it. I really would like to finish up my networking chapter seven tonight. It would be really awesome if I can, you know, sit down and really buckle in and just do it right. Um, then that's what's going to happen. Uh, we'll see what we'll see what goes down. Um, but you know, I have I've got another goal to kind of push forth to. And over the past month, month and a half since I've started this journey, so to speak, and you know. You guys have been on it with me. It's uh, it's good. It's good. It's it's a lot of personal development and it's learning how to um, focus my time. I think right or and it's a very hard thing to do. So it's to say, okay, I have thirty minutes to work out, and you spend those thirty minutes working out, or I have twenty seven minutes working out and three minutes of like breathing time before I go get a shower, and I should be in the shower. And it's 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 like hyper time management is kind of like my thought on it right like if you can if you can figure out how to manage your time and focus in on what you do for the 30 minutes that you have it's better than just going at it for two hours and not necessarily focusing for the two hours because you can still get more done in 30 minutes than you can in two hours if you manage that focus right and it's learning your own personal limits too 30 minutes to an hour is about all I usually have when it comes to studying uh, networking. Um, it's just that those are my limits, right? Um, and it's it's slowly getting better and better at focusing and doing it because my mind wanders a lot, guys. I know this may be a shocker and all for those who have listened to my videos and who, who know me, but my mind wanders and, and trying to figure out uh, because there's so many things that I would love to do and want to do and can do, right? Because there's no real limitations to humans than yourself um, and your your willingness to learn and grow. Um, I say that I say that uh, yeah, there is no real re limitation. You know, I mean, some people may be able to get a little farther than others just because of their skill sets. Like I, I know some people are just better readers than me or better writers than me. Um, just just literally from being born and whatever other things that they've learned in their life you know they may have spent 10 or 15 years reading books or i spent um 15 years playing games and i you know it's it's just how it is right um uh, but even within those gaps you know there's different things you know it's like sports whatever you know you know what i mean you know what i mean so i think that's something that that i'm gonna to go home I'm, when i get, get after i get done work uh with um, work today i'm gonna kind of see where and what i can do I've got, uh, I'm gonna finish up my binary course on my phone because I've got like about 30 minutes worth of videos I can watch. I'll do it for lunch. You know, I'll, I'll really listen and watch them, listen and watch my uh, watch my guy. I'm gonna re-listen to the original binary video that I that he had with the general understanding and learning of it uh, because it's been since Friday since I've watched it and then kind of go from there. But uh, yeah, talk to you guys soon. It's now time for me to work and I'm gonna go take a shit. Yeah. Hmm. All right, guys. Until next time.